Hello everyone and welcome to my very first edition of Heavenly Backyard Astronomy. Tonight I'm taking my 11 inch telescope and I'm going to be pointing it off to the east uh, around uh, 7 o'clock this evening and up near the constellation of Cancer is the Crab Nebula and I'm going to try to take several hours of views of this and then stack them all together and to give you an idea of how this is processed and the final results. Hopefully those results will be good. It's rather cold out here this evening. I'm getting set up right now. I have four layers of clothes on. I got a sweatshirt on, a t-shirt, another sweatshirt, and then this bigger sweatshirt on with uh, muffins so I can put my hands in here to help stay warm. It's not too bad right now. It's in the upper 40s, but it's going to be dropping down to the lower 30s by tomorrow morning. Hopefully I'll be done before then, but uh, anyway, I'll be setting up the scope. I got a new finder scope uh, set up for my tracking. I'm going to have to reset that now, and I'll see you later. Well, I'm back inside, and I'm tracking the Crab Nebula right now, taking a, a two-minute exposure, and I'm taking a bunch of them, 60 two-minute exposures. That's two hours uh, of, of data that I'll be um, processing. But I'm not all that happy with the tracking. Even though the tracking here says it looks pretty good, uh, I'm not getting the best tracking that I would like to have. However, the uh, uh, picture uh, from the camera itself off the telescope, this is an, a preview. You can see a little bit of star trailing going on across this area. So. It's, it's, it's a decent picture. There's the Crab Nebula right there of one of the pictures. I'll be stacking 60 pictures or uh, probably 45 of the best 60 pictures I'll be tracking. But that's what we're seeing so far. And uh, well, I'll, I'll be back later. Well, hello again. I was looking at the 122nd um, or 2-minute pictures. I wasn't quite satisfied with it, so I aborted after about a half hour of recording. Uh, the tracking was just not keeping up with it uh, to, uh, to my specifications. I had too many star trails, so I jumped it down to a 60-second view, and this is a 60-second view, and I changed the ISO rating from 1600 to 3200, so a little bit more grain in the picture, but maybe I'll be able to take that out with a new set of uh, darks that I'll take to help um, calibrate the camera a little bit better when I do the stacking process. But still, you can still get the Crab Nebula right in this area here, and uh, that should be very um, uh, entertaining to look after I stack these, hopefully. I'd have, the stars look a bit rounder, um, so it's, it's not trailing as much. Of course, it's only a half the time, uh, 60 seconds versus 120 seconds. But there you can see my tracking, it's kind of on. It's, it says it's within a degree each uh, either side of the center portion of the line, so it should be tracking pretty good, not a degree, a second of arc, uh, one second of arc. Um, see, my, my uh, uh, root mean square error is uh, less than one, so it's, it's pretty good, it says, but I'm still seeing um, star trails, so I'll, I'm going to have to deal with that. But here's a new picture coming in right now. Let's take a look at that. Uh, there it's getting ready to post, and it's just... Post it. Let's take another close-up look at this. Uh, the stars look pretty round. A little bit of a trail on them, so I'm still not satisfied. I don't know why. It's a learning curve. Okay, while I'm waiting for Photoshop to process 94 minutes of astrophotography, that's 94 frames of 60-second uh, exposure time at ISO 3200, I do want to let you know I did have a sky glow filter on my camera and this is a, also known as a CLS filter or City Light Pollution Suppression, CLS. And uh, you can see it attached to my camera here. This is the camera that actually attaches into the telescope uh, into the prime focus to take these pictures. It's a, um, in this case, it's a uh, Canon uh, T2i. Uh, that's what I'm using. And uh, while I'm waiting, it's just, uh, I just have to have some more of my Blue Moon draft beer. This is already 11.30. It's been going on for 20 minutes. Uh, it's getting close to being finished, but probably got another at least 10 minutes yet to go. I'll see you when it's done. Bye. 